A warning tonight and a plea for help. Eagle Point police say a man may be responsible for an attempted abduction in a family neighborhood. NBC 5's Nicole Stein is live in the newsroom with more. Nicole. Kristen, police are asking for the public's help tonight in finding a man they say may have tried to abduct a 15-year-old girl when she was walking home from a school event on Monday night. Residents in the area I spoke with are on high alert. In a quiet, family-friendly neighborhood in Eagle Point, it's a common sight to see kids walking home from school or playing outside. The kids used to run up and down the streets and have fun, play basketball and, and do all the normal things that kids do. Residents in the area around Crystal Drive say that's why they chose to live there. Everyone looks out for each other. Around here, we watch. People up and down the street watch everybody at everybody's house. We know when there is a different car in the, this neighborhood because we have, you know, a lot of people watching out for our children. But on Monday night, something out of the ordinary happened. Eagle Point police say late that night, a man may have tried to abduct a 15-year-old girl walking home from a school event. He said, I asked if he needed a ride and grabbed her on the arm and she moved forward. He grabbed her around the, the waist and she broke free. Backpack falls down she runs home. Police say the man was in his 40s or 50s, about 6 foot and 200 pounds. He was wearing a baseball hat, a dark long sleeve shirt and glasses. He was driving a 1980-style dark blue or gray pickup truck with Arizona license plates. It doesn't happen here very often. We're a very safe city, and that's by comments from people that say they feel safe in Eagle Point. It's something that makes Fred Hay uneasy. It makes me feel sad because, uh, you know, it's, people have to watch their kids so close, you know, and, and, and the kids kind of get paranoid about, you know, everybody that's, you know, you can't walk up and down and say hi to anybody anymore, hardly. And something Kathy Lloyd wants to talk with her son about. I will really have a talk with my son, re-talk, and just make sure that he knows, you know, not to get in a car with anyone he doesn't know and isn't safe. Again, police are asking for the public's help in finding the suspect. If you have, if you live in the area and have security cameras around your home or have any information, you're asked to call them. Live in the newsroom, Nicole Stein, NBC5 News.